When you walk into Hazel McCallion Central Library, you'll be greeted by a beautiful array of cascading lights in the north and south atrium. These installations are called Lightfall. Designed by Nathan Whitford, Lightfall is a new public artwork, part of a unique program dedicated to Mississauga's digital public art. We met with Nathan during installation and he told us some interesting things about his work. I think my inspiration for this design was, well, I mean, everything I do is somewhat site specific. So I was sort of working with the, the architect vision and what I saw the space to be. Obviously it's a library, so there's a lot to think about a lot to speak to about you know knowledge and the flow of knowledge and I like the idea of the, you know passing knowledge on to other people and sort of water flows in a similar way. Um, obviously you can't really put a waterfall in an atrium like this so I thought what do we do with light like how do we make it be like a waterfall of light so that's sort of what it's supposed to be it's called lightfall it's like a waterfall of light that also is like represents sort of the flow of information and knowledge. The, the actual structural part was decided a long time ago, but sort of what I do with the lights and how I program them. Um, and even now that I'm in the space now, I'm looking around and, and realizing that some of the ideas and the way I wanted to program it have actually, maybe I want to do it a little bit differently just to, just because it's, I'm seeing more color in here than I imagined in my lights and I think that looks really quite amazing. There's some interesting challenges in here because it's such a big atrium that, uh, you know, maybe it's interesting to know that I think there's about five kilometers of wire and then these two pieces together, uh, just because everything has to come up and then go all the way to a controller. I just wanted to make sure there's nowhere in the middle that can fail, right? I think that one of the things that uh, is interesting, we don't see now because it's not quite finished yet, um, but there is two atriums here and they're actually sort of, well, they're the, roughly the same installation. Um, but the idea is to draw a connection between these atriums and really, you know, and, and highlight the way that this building has been sort of expanded in the way that it, it wasn't before. Learn more about the renovation by visiting mississaugalibrary.ca slash reno or learn more about Mississauga's public art by visiting mississauga.ca slash public art.